Hey guys, welcome to uh, Farming Simulator 19, first look of Oakfield Farm, or would it be technically an old look? Well, I, I literally talked about this in the video I recorded early for tomorrow, saying, hey, we'll probably be doing some content on this. Um, well, he hello to our new map that we're going to be doing content on. Oxen David has given uh, myself, Simulation for the Nation, Virtual Farmer, and Rainbow Dave complete free reign on this map because it is a converted map. You guys have already seen it. There's nothing really to hide away and not show you guys. So he is planning on releasing this in two weeks' time. Yes, it will be for consoles. Yes, it's going to be for PC. Again, console people, listen to what I'm saying. It is going to be for you too. I know I'll still see those comments down below. So I'm going to hit start and I direct your attention to the sky. If you do not like the sound of three Merlin engines flying across the sky, there's something wrong with you. Welcome to Oakfield Farm. I don't know what to do on this because it's pretty much <laughs> where we left off last time. Hey, you got the house as we did before. This is going to be a short first look, I can tell you that much. You got the house. Go through here. Lighting, all that good stuff, you can go upstairs. Now, the easiest way of putting this, and I was just talking to Simulation for the Nation in TeamSpeak there, and he's like, so what's it like? And I went, it's oak filled with shaders. Because it truly freaking is. So that's the house, you guys know it. You know it. So we'll come out here into the yard, of course we've got the gates. Now, I've asked a lot of people what you guys want me to do with this map. And people are saying carry on from where you left on or left off, so that's what we plan to do. The sheds here, of course, they open. Uh Oxy, <laughs> you're missing something. Actually, do we have lights in there? The Punda. Oh yeah, right there. So there you go. Now this isn't a seed point anymore. There is a water, and I think he's still left the uh, fertilizer there, but I don't know if it's a fertilizer trigger anymore or whether it's just water. Now, you, there may be some issues that we stumble across. So, starter equipment is a John Deere 6R, the AgroLiner trailer. Uh, what have we got in the cold storage? But whoa, it's dark in here now. Uh, nothing in here. Oh, that's incredibly dark in there. Oh, it's early morning too. So, to be expected. Open up this, open up this. Uh, do we have anything in here? Nope. John Deere Combine. Uh, workshop's there. Side mower. The Hardy Sprayer. Oxy. I don't get that. Lower this down. <laughs> this needs to be smaller. Too big, too big. Uh, the slurry pit. That was. Oh no, no, that was there. That looks. No, that has moved. It has moved. This laneway never used to be here. Why is that? Why does that light switch seem so small? Nothing in there. So I'm just going around exploring the yard. This is really the first time I've been in here too. Oh, you've done some swapping around because this used to be over there. That's the... Oh, you have changed that up. That seems way smaller. What used to be here? Oh, Oxy, well, you've got me all messed up here. I can tell you that much. Damn. And that's... Oh, no, this is... Silage still. Okay, there's two silage bits. I can't remember if they both used to be there. Uh, the placeable field has now been replaced with a grass field. I don't know if there's any placeable fields per se anymore. Which, uh, it, it's easy to be swapped out and changed. I kind of would miss having the placeable, but again, you can do that yourself now. 
think these bows could do with bringing up their oxy or the land bring them bought down so that is the yard dairy here uh, so let's take a drive around I'll jump in this I'm gonna mosey on out so this map well second nature to me it's my favourite map in the farming simulator mods that have ever come out. It always will be. Always has. An extra building there. Hang on, I didn't see a cedar. Did you not give us a cedar? Oh, you did. Where have you got that hidden? Or is it around the back here? I never looked around here. Ah, yep. Here we are. In this building. Right. Okay. So you'll notice as well, so the lighting is the same off of Marwell, I presume. And it's way darker in some areas, that's for sure. FPS on this map I'm getting is rock solid, to be expected. No, I haven't gone absolutely everywhere. What's down there? Uh, with it yet. Oh, it's this field, okay. Well, so... Some areas may be a little stuttery at times. And that is due to, well, me just loading in the area. It's all from the lights, you guys can see it. Forestry area here, which I will probably do a wee bit of forestry on this map. I've got plans. So we'll take... All right, out of here. So you start off field-wise. Field 1, field 2, field 3... 51, field 9, field 13. Those are the fields. Row texture. Uh, definitely seems a different texture. It's nice. So this is the entrance going up to the main part of the farm, which is actually where we are going to head over to right now. Now for me, this it, it map is a favourite of mine because it's not too far where I'm originally from. It is literally the next county over from Wiltshire. So the terrain, the size of the fields is stuff that I am very much used to seeing. And the amount of people that used to come into the live streams, and they're probably still around, that have actually live around these fields, one of which works this... well, this area, this one of these fields. I don't know if, how many of them they actually work. And it was the big field, uh, field 16 there, the monster field, and they, I used to have this field too actually, no 50, yep, yeah, still got that, and he was saying it took a hell of a long time, I can't remember exactly, so I'm not even going to pretend I remember how long it took them, but with three 780 Lexians, it took them quite some time. It is a big field. All the fields are 100% true to life as well. So if you people are saying, oh, they're too big for the game. Well, the map, case in point, it's a satellite image map. It's 100% accurate as far as the fields go. There are going to be subtle changes as far as the yard and stuff goes. But as far as fields go, it is 100% accurate. Uh, the landscape, the hills and stuff like that is accurate as well. I wouldn't say it's 100% accurate because there is going to be some subtle changes. This is rocking as well, back when this map was made. Oxy's new discovered distant textures. So let's take a turn down here. It's one of the south points up here, if many of you remember the times of us lugging a heavy, heavy trailer queuing up here. Oh, we have field 7 and field 8, I believe, too. We'll have to buy those. To the south point there. So I'm just going to go down the roadways. Most of you know this map. Uh, and just really doing the first look for uh, announcement. Hey, guess what I'm going to be on. Now, we will do what we usually do with a brand new map. We will do a week of, starting from now. Well, actually starting from Wednesday. A week long of the map. Uh, there will be plenty of streams as well. I was getting set up and initially back to roughly where we were as we started to do the series, and then I'm going to continue the Oakfield series from where we left off. 
Uh, we were on episode 89. So to take note here. The birds. I may be probably one of few people my age who actually like the sound of birds tweeting. It's so nice. It really is. It's a nice atmosphere too. And that wouldn't bother me being that a lot more over the map actually. So uh, after we come out of here we will be taking a right turn. We'll head up to the pub. Now while setting up I'm pretty much going to buy up all the locations I had. Uh, so I believe we even had Field. What field was it up there? 33 I think we had? And 27? Something like that. So it's amazing how dark it is in, in, in the shadows. I don't know whether it will be better during the day when it lightens up. I would imagine so. So this map, I hopefully should progress through testing when it has been uploaded to Giants relatively quickly. Uh, so we're at Oak Glen Farm. This used to be the pig area. Presumably it still is. Yep. There's the darn things. Uh, the sheep, I believe, are still at the main yard. I think. Looks like they are. So here is the farm. This has actually changed up. That's new. I always said this would be perfect if we could get into it. And I don't think he's done it. Nah. Ah, it's a shame. It'd be a nice little building, that. There's a drop point. So yeah, not too much has changed down here. He seems smaller. He seemed way smaller. Uh, again, we see the fertilizer tanks. I don't know if they th function or not. Uh, I really don't. We'll find that out during the live stream tonight. Like I've said, I do plan on streaming as soon as possible. So you can go through the hedge if you guys are wondering on that one. Oxy's magic collisions. Uh, this field down here we had, that was our placeable yard for the uh, compost and all of that stuff that used to be up in the greenhouse. My guess is that is now gone. That's our point. It's probably been sorted out to manure, I would imagine. Aha! He's changed up the roundabout and made it nice. I was hoping he would do something like that. Needs to be the entrance down to that. Oh, what's up with that sign? Uh, yeah, there's something going on there. It's very shiny. Very shiny indeed. Uh, traffic. I don't know if Foxy sped that up. Actually, then, has he sped the traffic up? I was just trying to pace that, it's hard to say. And the Seven Springs Pub. Used to have people walking around here, I think. And there. Uh, and gone. Scenic vehicles. Yeah, South Point, I'm not too sure for what. Dave's uh, not so tasty burgers right there. Trust me, don't try them. Uh, that lay by there, I want to say, could be new too, actually. Uh, maybe wrong. New Holland dealership. Again, same old, nothing much here changed. Although, yes, something has changed. We've lost the combine that used to be sticking out of here. So there is a collision there, so you can't go back there. There used to be a broken up combine there. Where these tyres come from. Uh, Oxy, I know you'll be watching this. These tyres and some of the older stuff that you've got from uh, 15. Double check for, seven to, uh, for 19. They could cause issues, probably. Unless you're running MMR while. Here is the BGA. Now, the BGA is probably not got... 
silage pits? No, it does not. So he hasn't forgotten to put them in there. It's so you guys can put your own down. I'm not too sure his reasoning behind it, but you guys can put your pits down. You will need to buy the area, though. Just a reminder. Another sell point over here, which I think used to be the same area you could sell... Uh, wool and all of that stuff. Yep, so in theory... Um, cotton bales can go in that. Actually, yeah, this map would be a good map to do some cotton on. Granted, it's not done in the UK, I know, but it'd be a decent map for it. Uh, okay, where else shall we go from here? We can go all the way up to the animal dealer. Uh, just to say I've been up there and actually check out some of the castle and some of the more scenic locations. So the castle is up here, got some pedestrians walking around. No pet. SUV sort of thing, caravan. So we'll go up to the castle and check that out. See what is what there. It's such a beautiful map, this. I I'm gonna be biased. Like, I'll straight up say. As I opened up the video, I'm pretty sure I said, this is my favourite map that existed in Farming Simulator, and it still is. Marwile is a fantastic map, but I prefer this. So, I know I'm going to get the question in the stream later, what do you prefer? And that's Castle. Yeah, I'm always going to get back to this one. I'm sorry, guys. I'm always going to get back to it. Now we'll roll down the hill here. Incredibly street, steep hill. Streep? No. Incredibly steep hill, yep. Inca incredibly steep hill. There we go. English. Uh, we'll head up this and steep hill. When you got a full load on, you know it coming up here. Although, really, the only, way, the only reason you'd be coming up here is for the animals. Or if you're going across into these fields, I guess. If you still wished. Now, the animal dealer's probably not changed, to be quite honest with you. Now, obviously, the traffic. It has not been sped up as we're going past that at 32 mile an hour. It would be nice the traffic get to get tweaked to hair. I think Oxy had to was trying to figure out how to do that, but it's due to it being in the base game now. What did that say then? Golden yarn spinnery. Oh. Uh yeah, that's an issue. Frontier Livestock Market, Golden Yarn Spinnery. <laughs> I wonder why that was multicolored. Well, there you go. So that's obviously from uh, the American map. Yeah, same here. Yeah, all of those signs. So, the animal point here. And back down we go. And um, what we'll do is we'll check up upon uh, past the lime. Oh, is that oh the lime stations there? The XL point is up top there. And the stable. I wonder if there's actual proper stables for horses built into the map as well. I'm not too sure. And that's probably where we'll wrap it up. Like I said, this is more of a overview this is what it looks like in 19 some subtle changes that I've noticed already because we've seen this map and many of us know and played the living snot out of it so nothing's really new per se interest to the BGA that that used to be that I'm second guessing because I know there's a lot stuff that has changed you know what, I think it's just that sign that's all messed up. I think it's a chrome sign. That sign always used to be funky too. Even in the uh, normal. Let's actually quickly check these. Now see, these are to be expected, but and that one. But that one is most definitely messed up. Yeah, it's got the chrome on it. So 
two. A siren says to there. The other signs. Big area. And that's going to be the road that we shoot up to take a look see. Oh, there's a wall there. GG. I anticipate nothing much change here. This is the fence, posts, chicken area. Like always used to be. Down there, you can feed them and everything, and all that good stuff. There's the egg boxes down there. I think we had some chickens too. Now I'm going to try and get all the animals that we did before. I'm not going to have pigs until we've got a pig feed mixer. I do miss that quite a lot. So, anyone wondering, this is the first look of the underneath the, the John Deere as well. I'm even going to be able to get this in stock. No, no, I'm not. Right, we'll abandon that. We'll carry on on foot. So, horse stables. Again, I don't know if these are actually physical, functional horse stables or whether it's scenery per se. Or whether Oxy's even putting some straight up horse stables in. Uh, which, by the looks of things, it's here. Oh, yeah, I can see the. Horse icon. So the, yeah, the actual stables are here. Sweet. Now we're carrying up the hill. Yeah, it wasn't this field we had, it was that one. That annoying round in there. Was it? Yeah, we had that one in the other one. I'm remembering now, I'm seeing it. So I think this looped around. Oh, I almost looped around. I always said it would be nice if it actually did. And then we can go. We'll just run straight across the field. Over to Empire Stores. I want to see if the uh, compost is still there or not. Which I doubt. So I don't think that's in the game. It would be nice if I wasn't actually in the game. I feel like a criminal jumping through everyone's back gardens. There's the damn road. There we are. Have I gone past it? Oh no, it's just down here. Birds tweeding away again. In here. And it's still got the manure steaming away. But those are good. And yeah, it has gone. It used to be here. So you can now put that as storage if you so wish. And I believe. Oh, what was the forest name now? I forget. Oh, that was the interest of the forest too, right? Yeah. This is where we had our leaf hairs and all of that stuff, if you guys remember. Now I'm actually. Back in it, I'm remembering. Yeah, that's right too. Big old forestry area. More than enough for most people. So, there you go. In a nutshell, this is the map. Oh, we'll quickly take you back down to the yard. I hope you've enjoyed the first old look of Oakfield Farm. Yeah, I'm happy to be back on it, and I hope you guys enjoy the map as much as I used to, and as much as I will continue to enjoy it. It's definitely, definitely one of my top picks. Favourite maps. Yeah, and just to confirm that it's a sheep area right here. They've got quite a big area. Here's the yard. Not much has changed other than that little cut through. Uh, but it looks things going through there. There's probably a lot of changes that I've just overlooked. And Oxy's yelling at his computer screen telling me. But uh, alas, I can't hear you. <laughs> so until next time, guys, I hope you enjoy. And uh, we'll be continuing the series. Ace up. Later.